Hi. Uh, in this video, I will scan the range with the CS scan letter and upper. Uh, this range has a metallic surface and it also has the embossed uh, text. So we can compare the scanning detail uh, in Blender side by side. And I will also do the accuracy verification. It's about 13 point something millimeters between these uh, lips here. So uh, let's get started. Uh, I will um, put uh, the wrench in this uh, flat position. I raise it a bit uh, with this uh, cube here so that I can uh, scan some off side of the wrench. Uh, the reason that I do not put it in this position because uh, I have already tried it. Um, the, the edge here is uh, has a sharp corner and when the uh, laser reflects on the sharp corner, it will not uh, scan some part uh, because of the the reflection from the sharp edge. I can also put in the, this the vertical position, but uh, when I turn the table, it will uh, wobble. So the best way is to put it in a flat position like this, and then I scan one time at the front and one time at the back, and then I will merge it in the software. So this will also test the ability of the Creality Scan software for merging, because the thickness of this range is only 4.2 millimeters. So uh, the overlap area is the edge here. So it's only 4.2 millimeters. Uh, the software has to be um, be able to merge uh, the two point clouds this thin. I will uh, start with the lab there first. Uh, resolution 0 0.15, uh, brightness is auto and IR exposure is manual. Make another scan. Flip it over. Now I'll try with the water. I found that the land yard that they give is too short. I mean, if you have a big hands, but if you hold this orientation, uh, it's better.
uh, we process the point cloud start with the adapter here's the result should have a sharp edge do it like this I process the uh, water 167,000 point clouds from the author and uh, 500,000 point clouds from the laptop so it's about uh, more than twice higher density than the author is a uh, author in the front uh, about the same density uh, compare here with the laptop it gives more than twice the density of the point clouds I start the merging process with the laptop first one thing to know that merging is not non-reversible after you merge and then you click con confirm you can go back to individual scans uh, like this uh, menu laptop front laptop back and then I uh, uh, here's the front here is the the back one one uh, two two and uh, three uh, I have no idea if it is can uh, they can run it uh, let's try all right uh, this looks all right huh Oh, that's incredible. They can uh, align a thin with a small height. I click, after you click yes, uh, there's no going back. The laptop front and laptop back uh, files that were scanned will be gone. Now we have it. The laptop. I will uh, export uh, the point clouds. Okay, and then I pair uh, other. Uh, see here one, one, two, two, and uh, three. Okay, so we have uh, about 320,000 uh, point clouds versus uh, 1 million. So, Laptor has uh, three times the resolution. Uh, with the same uh, resolution setting 0 0.1 millimeter so we have a range I measure the distance uh, between the lips here right 13.28 okay let's uh, put it like this about 13 millimeters 13.53 actually almost the same 13.53 uh, 0.37 uh, here's the result in render uh, the, the mesh is not processed uh, right out of the creative scan software uh, we have uh, 1.7 million faces for the letter and uh, 400,000 faces for the other uh, this is the maximum output value that can be output from the scanner